First of all, I want to introduce myself. My name is Naim Siddiqui and I will tell you a little bit background and timeline of the Volkswagen emission scandal. So, uh, Volkswagen headquarters is located at Wolfsburg, Germany, which is the one of the most iconic and famous automobile manufacturer in the world. This company was founded by the Nazi Socialist Party under the rule of Adolf Hitler in 1937. In 2014, Volkswagen became the second biggest car manufacturer after Toyota. But in the first half of 2015, which is from month of January until June, Volkswagen overtook Toyota with 5.04 million units sold, compared to Toyota with only 5.0 units sold. But for the next six months, Toyota accomplished to get a total sale of 10.15 million units compared to Volkswagen. We've only managed to get a total sale of 9.93 million units. So uh, you must wonder why Volkswagen company can maintain their leading in the sale until the end of 2015, right? This is because of the emission scandal that happened in the company and later I will tell you about the timeline of the problem that happened in the Volkswagen company. Once the world's top automaker Volkswagen has fallen to number two, one reason, the company admit it rigged 11 million vehicles worldwide to trade on emission tests. Here is a breakdown of the scandal blow by blow. A group of scientists at West Virginia University discovered that Volkswagen was using software in its diesel car to cheat on clean air tests. When the car is being tested, the engine then runs differently making the emissions seem cleaner than they ordinarily are. They find emissions are up to 40 times higher than legal limit, but the company repeatedly denies the claim to US official. This problem affecting 11 million cars worldwide. CEO Martin Winterkorn apologized and resigned. He is replaced by Matthias Muller, the head of Volkswagen in Porsche brand. Meanwhile, Volkswagen is hit by endless lawsuits from customers upset that their car have lost value because of their software. In April 2016, Volkswagen announced to start recalling the 8.5 million affected cars across the Europe. The company says that they will be fixed by the end of the 2016. Hey guys, have you ever wondered why Volkswagen willing to cheat? What makes all of this happen? Of course, there are a lot of reasons. First and foremost, the agenda of the company itself is to become the biggest car manufacturer in the world. Therefore, they came up with a resolution to use fuel-efficient diesel engines instead of petrol engines to compete with Toyota. As we all know, diesel engines is more powerful than petrol engines because it has high fuel efficiency and high endurance over time. However, diesel engines will generate more hazardous gases like nitrogen oxide which means they have to install the air and fuel filters in the vehicle system. Hmm, I guess it will cost a lot of money. Volkswagen scandal occurred due to the technology shortcoming, which had prompted Volkswagen to cheat in emission tests. United States Environmental Protection Agency, US EPA, has imposed toughest emission standard to the automobile industry. However, in diesel engine, it must trade off uh, between power, fuel efficiency, and also clean emission where a vehicle can have two from these three characteristics. So, the engineers cannot discover any solution to suit with the EPA emission standard within the given time and also they had experienced budget shortage. And that is why Volkswagen had decided to embed computer software that will change the engine setting for lowering the nitrogen oxide emission so that the nitrogen oxide emission will look lower when in its reality it is not. What? Other than technology shortcoming, the unique corporate culture of the company also had become the significant reasons for Volkswagen scandal. The culture of Volkswagen is compliance based, which employees are obliged to comply the rules. This culture has led to an atmosphere where the demand and expectation must be fulfilled no matter what. 
Volkswagen company is more having like autocratic culture rather than democratic. This is because Volkswagen is famous for its avoiding argument and discussion culture. Uh, and its human resource also had been trained to tell the employees to consider the task and find the best solution no matter what happened because if not there are a lot of other candidates that are more proficient and efficient in doing their job all right last but not least another reason for this scandal to be kept secret for quite some time is the rewarding system it means what they can provide or give reward bonus to the employees that enforce them to remain silent about this issue for your information this system is applied to all positions but the amount of bonus differ based on their wage it means the higher position you are in the more bonus you will get from 2008 to 2015 about 428,000 of Volkswagen cars released the nitrogen oxide. The nitrogen oxide is 40 times exceeding the limit that was allowed by the law. Actually, the nitrogen oxide is one of the primary factors that can cause various types of illness, especially involving the respiratory system. This include the chronic bronchitis, heart disease, cardiovascular disease, and the worst one is death. So this nitrogen oxide is not only affect to the people health, but it is also resulting to the acid rain, which impacts to the nature and the natural resources. This consequences is not only affected to the people outside of the Volkswagen, but it is also affected to the people in the Volkswagen company. For example, the dealers. So dealer is a person that um, buy and sell insecurities for their own account. So when this issue happens, the dealer is facing with a big mess problem. So before this, the Volkswagen of America gave extra money as discretionary fund to the dealers and they can use it as they wish. Unfortunately, the crisis grew significantly. So the dealers facing with a big problem whereby they can't sell the diesel cars. Then the dealer facing with a big dilemma whether the fund given is enough or not. So in order to overcome with this issue, the Volkswagen of America stated that there will be further program in order to gain the fund including the cash flow as the consideration for the dealers. Hi, I am Nur Alena and I am going to continue with another three impacts of the Volkswagen scandal that happened in the industry. Firstly, the Volkswagen scandal had caused the decline in Volkswagen's vehicle sales and it was quite serious where the the brands of the group such as Audi, Bugatti and also Bentley were affected and this results in drastic drop in the sales throughout the year. Uh, in 2015, the sales of Volkswagen's vehicles were very low compared to another year and at that time, the company lost almost $1.84 billion. Despite having the decline in Volkswagen's vehicle sales, the Volkswagen's workforce incentives were also reduced where the Volkswagen's uh, announced that the chief executive bonus together with the board director bonus would be dramatically decreased in order to cope and to deal with the crisis. And last but not least, the Volkswagen scandal had also contributed to a drastic drop in the uh, company's share price. As a result, the company's share value were reduced by one third and this drastic drop results in billions of dollar washout of the valuation of the Volkswagen itself. On 21st April 2016 in California, a judge in US stated that BW Company has come with a realistic proposal. To solve and finalize an allegation which Volkswagen cheated in an emissions test by setting up a defeat device in the car engine and the proposal has been endorsed by US government agencies and also environmental protection agencies EPA. Okay, so an agreement is suggested which allows the VW cars to fix their cars based on the US emission standard or to resell back their cars to the VW company. 
the civil agreement requires significant compensation for two liter diesel car. However, the details of compensation considered for the car owners are not exposed, while compensation for three liter diesel Volkswagen cars are still in progress. Instead of squandering huge amount on penalties, it has been suggested to spend the amount of penalty to advance traditional technology by demanding Volkswagen to focus on electric vehicles as it will be more advantageous. Furthermore, the higher number of electronic vehicles on the road privilege economy by increasing the needs of batteries. NG Zhao has also done some analysis on this issue and proposed a few practical solutions. Since Volkswagen Group is one of the largest automotive brands, the first suggestion is for the company to come out as a smaller, more competitive company with a completely brand new name. This idea has also been considered by some of the Volkswagen executives as they believe it would be easier for the business to speed up its initiatives of productivity. Secondly, it is suggested that Volkswagen collaborate with other independent verification agencies regardless of having their own emission investigation internal team as to regain customers' trust while at the same time gain recognition and incentives from the NGOs. Another method that Volkswagen can consider is to issue a bond that guarantees nothing like this will happen again in the future. A bond simply indicates the credibility of the company. It is necessary that the bond is set at a very high amount to show that they truly regret cheating emission regulations before. This would mean that one of their brands should be sold in order to fund the bond in which the money obtained can be used to post the bond, pay out payments and government, as well as focusing on the research and development. In conclusion for Volkswagen scandal, so this issue occurred in 2015 involving a well-known automobile company which is Volkswagen. So the major issue in this scandal is the rigging of emission tests to pass the emission standards by altering the result of emission level from the engine. From this, it will affect the environment and also to human health. But eventually, the negative Impact also backlash them as consequence for their wrongdoings, uh, which gave negative impacts such as uh, the decreasing in sales, shares, and finance. From this, Volkswagen was prosecuted for their fraud. So this issue teach us not to perform unethical action in order to achieve something in our life. So from Islamic view, fraud and cheating is not so good to be practiced and immoral action and also prohibited in our religion. As Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam also warned us and issued caution to those who do it. Hence, the implementation of integrity in our life is an important thing uh, in order to smooth our life and also contributes to positive outcomes hope you like our presentation thank you for watching stay safe stay calm and keep healthy assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh